Hi and welcome to this DCP Web Blender 2.8 tutorial. So I'm just going to open up my web browser and on this particular video I created there's a comment. I want to help this guy out. He says, um, excellent tutorial. Can you tell me how to render without the black background? I'm exporting in PNG. I need to remove the background. If I disconnect the background node, it's still black. So let's try and help him out and show him how you can render an image as a transparent PNG. So you could render out a sequence of PNG files with transparent background. You can take that into your editor, uh, your video editor, and you can sequence them, to get them together and put a different background behind it. So let's help him out and show him how to export PNG files with transparent backgrounds using Blender 2.8. Okay, so on my desktop I have this folder and inside this folder I've got this little blender file. Let's open it up. This is a project that I created before previously. So if you've been watching my channel, I showed you how to make this little sci-fi spaceship. And we created this in Blender with a series of a few videos. We made this little sci-fi spaceship and it's all animated and all that good stuff. And you know, it does all this good stuff. So we want to just capture um, a view of this and then render out the, the spaceship but without any background. That's what this guy wants to find out how to do. So let's just position the camera, Control Alt Zero. So I'm going to move the camera to here, press Shift and F. I just want to zoom in a little bit and I'll just grab the camera. So let's just say we want to take this particular picture without the black background. If I press F12 right now, we'll render it and you can see the black background, right? So I haven't done anything with the background here. You want to keep your background active here. Make sure that it's still active in your nodes, right? Um, but what we'll do is go to the render settings here scroll right down to the bottom go to film and then turn on transparent here turn this on transparent now the key is when you go to your uh, output settings make sure you set it to rgba for the alpha channel has to be rgba right if we click um the if we just press f12 now we can render this out and now you can see it's rendered without the um background so let's test that let's go to file save as and we'll save this uh into the folder so let's just call it trans uh, let's do transparent test dash zero one so we save it as a little png file let's save that let's close this minimize so in this folder we now have a transparent png let's just actually make sure it's transparent let's double check for this guy so we'll open up the browser let's go to pixabay and then we'll type in here space or something let's download a picture let's use uh, something like uh, this Milky Way will be good. Let's just download this and we'll test it to make sure it's transparent. Uh, it's always worth checking. Uh, so let's try and help this guy out. Let's go to here. Let's go to uh, let's get let's do this in could do this in GIMP, but let's just uh, let's just use Photoshop if I can find it. Here it is. And let's see we can get this to work we should be able to I can't see why not here's Photoshop okay here's Photoshop let's just go ahead and drag and drop this Milky Way into Photoshop and then let's drag a transparent test into here as well and there you go it's transparent right that's what we wanted or that's what the gentleman wanted so now you have your transparent, it's nice clean edges, everything's cut. So you don't have to go into Photoshop and start cutting things out. You might as well just render it straight out of um, Blender using transparency. So the one key thing to do is if you're going to render out um, a video sequence, then you really want to render out a PNG sequence, right? So just remember that when you go to your output settings, set it to PNG, RG, PNG RGBA. And then um, in your output folder, you want to render out a sequence of PNG files if you've got some animation sequence in there. You can see this has got like some animations in there, right? The one thing I think might be an issue, maybe someone else can help me with this, but you can see there's glowing edges on this. You can see there is um you can see there is actually a bloom setting, right? So if I turn the bloom on and off, if I turn it on, when I export this file, uh, it seems to remove the bloom. Can you see? The bloom is getting removed from the picture so I've not figured out how to fix that maybe someone knows how to render this out as a transparent PNG but retain that bloom that glow so it would be nice to retain it but maybe that's just not possible if you want a PNG transparent but obviously you could add that glow in Photoshop or you could do some other stuff to get that but it would have been nice if um, that glow was uh, 
retained but I haven't figured out a way to do that maybe there's some other options in here to help um, to help do that but I haven't managed to figure it out so if anyone knows that please do help me out and help this gentleman out but for now at least we can render out a transparent PNG okay hope you find that tutorial useful and I look forward to seeing you in the next DCP web tutorial <laughs>